seems very difficult to set up. It's Splice! All right, we saw it in the hands of Jezus. I didn't think we'd see it anywhere else, but they're picking up the fiddlesticks for themselves. They very well go for an early tier map to help with the wave clear during the laning phase. We see an all-in from Ignar. A little aggressive here. Three stacks, four stacks on the concussive blows. Moving in onto Mickey. Ignite is down. The look behind, Kakao. Here he comes. Maybe look for a little bit more. Exhaust. I don't think it's going to be enough. Kakao with the board. Flash in. Heal up. Kabi sidestepping. Fancy footwork. Moving in. Yeah, and Kakao is actually dangerously getting low here. So many minions. He comes right in. Ignar. Oh. One more shot. Trying to follow the flash. Q flash looking for the auto. Doesn't quite connect. The bird, the bird. Where is it at? Bounce. It gets destroyed. It gets destroyed by Braum Shields. Maybe going to look for larger objectives as we push further into the game. Trashy getting aggressive. Maybe just another pressure game. All right, Trashy. Use that shotgun. <laughs> Give us a kill. He wants more. He wants more. It's oh, he's Mickey. Oh, Mickey goes in. That's the Crow Storm. Ignar potentially in trouble. Nice sidestep though on the collateral damage. And here comes Kakao. Moves forward. Shen on the way in as well. But he misses the Bola. That's disaster. Now Misfits are going to have to back off here. And they're just getting chipped out. They're just getting poked down. Alt goes in. Now debating what they want to do next. Moving forward. Misfits slowly but surely. Syndra. I just throw out the scatter of the week for the disengage. Both sides backing off. For now, Splice 26,000 gold here. Misfits just shy of 24, and that's a very slow bird. There it goes. Slowly but surely. Oh, there goes POE. Evil crows over the wall. Down he goes. First blood for trash. They didn't know. The crowd hadn't arrived yet. You know, it was going to the fountain. They had no idea where Fiddlesticks was. They forgot. All right. Pick on a fat kit. Wonder as a oh. flash. Body slam. Forward. He, he Awkward only has one flash. Moment. <laughs> Wonder. Going to go down here, all but assuredly moves in. Concussive blow stacks goes in. It takes everything they've got, but Misfits managed to get something back. And Misfits, they're not being allowed into their own jungle, but Mickey. Oh, Mickey, maybe overextending here, pulling back. There's the Shen ult. They're trying to find a way back in. Terrify comes out, but Mickey gets stunned up. Kakao, he's looking for more. Leaps forward, does leap out immediately as Kabi finds the disengage. Splice, you want to be controlling your vision, but you have to make sure that you get the push first. Mickey walking in by himself is just asking for Misfits to find that pick. They get it, and now they can reclaim control of the yeah. Small error, and basically they have to wait for Wunder. If Wunder is in range to cancel the Shen ulti, Splice can still fight out that kind of 4v4 or maybe 3v4, especially when they're kiting. The problem is, Mickey went too deep and there was no cancel on the channel deep. And now POE is under pressure. Play his Doxin back, flash out from power though, finds a brief moment to escape and will live in the end. But it's really important that you kind of poke him low enough, because then Victor can no longer step up to clean, and Kobe is so oh, confident here. Back, double knock up from Ignar, maybe looking for a little bit more. Flash taunt in, Sandcux is locked up. Will he get knocked out? Haunts him on the front lines. Down goes Sandcux, they might look for more. Kobe, four stacks with the blows. He drops, that's the double. They're pushing in another taunt from Alfari. Wonder is in trouble, he may just get taken out. There it is, Misfits back in control. Never thought I, as a play-by-play -play caster, would be arguing against <laughs> violence in League of Legends. Right, now we see how hard it is, because Trashy essentially just face checked the brush, and they didn't know they have prior on the mid lane, and now we get to follow exactly how hard it is. Because suddenly, Edar's there. What's he doing there? Sama! Out goes the Victor Ultimate as well. It's a lot of damage. Mickey pulling back. Redemption holding on, but in goes Alfari again. The Shen CC in this fight is sick. Ha! You guys thought they were just warding. Psych! Misfits set up the trap. We even trapped us, and that is exactly why this Misfits versus Spice mid game has been so stagnant. Because exactly that could happen at any time if you just make the slightest error in calculation. But Grab now the Baron has been started. Splice, they want to try and contest. Holding on for now. Out comes the Locket, moving forward onto Wonder. Kabi in the back line, still dishing out damage. Kakao leaping, trying to make it out to safety, but Kabi is on the hunt, looking for a little bit more. Tick down goes the red buff. Accidentally hits the Baron, moving in. The heal comes out there safe for now, but Senkux takes down Alfari. Power of Evil moving in. He is fearless. But Misfits, they're starting to fall apart a little bit. They're pulling back. Power of Evil wants to get something. Yeah, this is the Misfits turning. Huge cannon oh, ultimate. That's a jungle death. Senkux in. under pressure. Pulling back now, though. Misfits backing off, but it is not the win that they wanted. If you used to play with Fiddlesticks, you support a flashing press Q, and then you have to gamble. <laughs> Where is this guy <laughs> going to go? Is, is he, he left? Is he right? Is he going to play like Kaga? But now, right, you know, he moves away from Fiddlesticks. Much easier for you uh, to predict skill shots. Ignar. see on the hunt. Now comes the Shen. Find him in the funnel. It does catch Senkux. Moving in, moving forward. Alfari gets another top power. People comes over the wall. That's a lot of damage. Senkux goes down. In comes the cannon. The fight is kicking off. But Kabi's alive. Kabi is healthy. Crow Storm comes out. This is the turn from Splice. Alfari's hitting the back line, but nobody cares. They move in. Kabi's on a tear. He wants Ignar as well. Clean fight from Splice. It looked so pretty, but you cannot leave an Ezreal alive in a late game team fight. He will just ramp up that path. 
passive, ramp up the damage and he will tear you apart. Kobe, definitely the MVP with honorable mention going to Mickey. And Misfits in that fight, it just looked too good for them because you saw Power of Evil flashing in from over the wall. You do not want to be that close into a fight as a victor. You get a lot of burst damage down onto Senkuk, sure, but as you rightly said, Krupper, with this main damage dealer alive, Splice have won the fight. They may very well look to end the game. And they're definitely looking for their first Nexus turret here. Wunder is tanking. They're waiting for the minions who are painfully slow, getting their half a turret it's down. It's only one member up just now. That's Kakao. I think they're actually going to do it. Coming back. Braum with just a little bit more time, but it's not enough. He gets belly bob. Three members strong, focusing their sights on the Nexus, and that's going to be game one for Splice.